بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى عليه وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبت في الله جاء في صحيح من حديث سهيب رضي الله تعالى عنه أن النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم قال عجب لأمر مؤمن إن أمره كله خير وليس ذلك وليس ذاك لأحد إلا للمؤمن إن أصابته سراء شكر فكان خيرا له وإن أصابته ضراء صبر فكان خيرا له أخرجه مسلم This is a hadith in Sahih Muslim And in this hadith of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam the hadith of uh, Suhaib radiallahu ta'ala he said that the messenger of Allah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam said the mu'mins, the believers affair is strange uh, and all of it is good and this is not the case except for the believer if goodness or something that is that pleases him happens he is thankful and grateful and this is better for him and if something harmful happens to him or difficult befalls him difficulty befalls him then he is patient and this is better for him and this is only the case of the movement the mufti of Saudi Arabia he mentions regarding this hadith of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam he said that the Muslim fi hadhi dunya bayna amri the Muslim in this life is between two uh, two affairs if you will or two issues or two uh, two conditions إما نعم متواصلة أو ابتلاء كثيرة فالمسلم مع الحالين مع الضراء صابرا وما صراء شاكرا So he said the, the believer, the, the Muslim is between uh, these two affairs either he receives some sort of uh, a continual blessing or that he is tested with difficulty often and the Muslim is in relation to this either harmed when he is harmed he is patient and when he finds this happiness and ease he is grateful and in this state it shows us that the believer that he is not so caught up in the affairs of the world. You know, he's, he doesn't go to polar opposites. He's not excessively happy and excessively uh, sad because the dunya, he doesn't place extreme importance on this worldly life. And he is happy, he or she is happy with the decree of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the judgment of Allah tabarak wa ta'ala. So if difficulty, trials and tribulations, sickness befall him, he, is, he or she is firm upon their religion and in their iman. And if difficulty befalls them, they are patient with that harm. And if ease and they are favored, then they are grateful and thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And this helps the believer to live a beautiful and fruitful life. And may Allah Azza wa Jal bless us with ilm al nafiyah wa rizq al tayyibah wa amal al mutaqabbil and bless us to be of those who live a healthy and fruitful life. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.